So today's stock demonstration has really been our opportunity to work alongside of our partners uh, in order to showcase not only the dock hardware, but also the software and the functions which dock affords. So we've reached this maturity in terms of what we can do with current drone solutions. And the next step that made sense is going beyond what already existed and this idea of having potential automation and resolving issues that were difficult to deal with, with the current remote pilots having to be on site. With DJI Dock, uh, what has happened is the docking station hardware has become very accessible, very reliable, and you know, very available at a very affordable price. So this is completely going to change this industry. It is making it accessible and possible for so many customers to start using this technology for their autonomous fleets of drones. Some of the early adopters of this technology have been in rail yard uh, management, in oil and gas pipeline uh, inspections for public safety. Uh, which is a huge use case in itself and in many other emergency response kind of situations. Without a dock, you cannot build other layers which are important for autonomy. So dock is your fundamental building block for autonomy. So the importance of Drone Harmony use in the case of DJI dock is really when you want to scale vertical flights. It's basically a, a Swiss army knife for planning complicated complex 3D flights at your construction sites at difficult to reach places. We have automated obstacle avoidance in the flight planning engine and so this makes it stand out and it's also our unique selling point when you want to use that together with the DJI dock. We have a client that is looking at transmission substations where they want to actually fly every week across 60, 70 such substations and they're looking to install in each of these substations a DJI dock and using our flight planning because substations you can imagine you have a lot of power lines and you want to be sure that your flights are safe so Drone Harmony is a perfect uh, solution in that space. I can see a, a situation where a drone in a box solution would be deployed on a job site at the beginning of the earth move with a remote pilot which means during an activity where there's frequent earth move, a lot of change, can fly every day. It may be then that the activity drops off, so you only need to fly weekly or, or bi-weekly or whatever, but it gives you that flexibility without being dependent on the availability of that person at the site to actually fly and map and understand 100% of what's going on on your job site. So the biggest challenge that we see right now is from the regulatory side, BV laws. So we have been investing heavily in safety. So safety becomes paramount when you're talking about any kind of automated system, because now there is no human uh, observer or no human in the loop. Now your systems have to be designed in a way that they are super safe and reliable. That is where you know, Flightbase has been doing a lot of integrations with variety of safety systems uh, like your UTMs and parachute systems and ADSVs and sense and avoid systems, weather systems. And that has helped us get BV loss approvals in eight countries so far. What that helps you understand is uh, the level of safety checks that have been designed in the system that we were able to convince so many different regulators to give us and our customers the approvals for BV loss flights. And with all this knowledge and understanding, it is now becoming easier and easier that we can go to other regulators, show them all that precedence that yes, this is what we have already done, this is what we have already achieved with other regulators. So you know, it becomes easier to build that safety case in any new geography. So the CEA recently opened the Future Remote Pilot Competency Framework Public Consultation. That closed on the 23rd of August 2023, which really gave us a positive indication of the future competency requirements for beyond visual line of sight, including systems such as DJI Dock. Using DJI Dock now provides organisations with the opportunity to get used to not only the hardware but also the software workflows. So come the time where it becomes potential to operate BV loss under a predefined risk assessment, really those entities who are already familiar with the system gives them the opportunity then to hit the ground running as it were. Let's not wait for regulations to be in place, let's get started now.